Hey everyone, it's been so long since I've talked to you guys and I so miss you. It's been, I don't even know how long it's been and it's been so much going on in my life, good and bad. Um, let's get started, I don't know, I'm so excited because there's so much going on. I know you're probably wondering about my hair. I think the last time I talked to you, I was thinking about what kind of hair I was going to get. Well, I've had plenty of hair cells in between. Basically... No, I didn't because in January I got a relaxer and in April I got a relaxer. So, no. So, yeah, right now what I am doing, I'm going to go ahead and take it down, is micros. Yes, yes, yes. For so many different reasons. And I don't know if you can see that, but these are the micros. And tomorrow I should be finished because I only have like this much to do, which is not that much because. Like, most of the back is finished. I'll give you a better view of it tomorrow. But I just wanted to let you know that I was putting some micros in my hair. Anyway, you can see the micros. Like, they'll be finished tomorrow. They're, I can't wait so you can get a better look at it all anyways. But, yes, I am so excited to see you guys. Or talk to you guys, I should say. Because I can't see you. You can see me. But, let me see. Um... Like I said, I don't remember exactly when I stopped making videos, but um, my cousin got married in January. I was part of the wedding. Um, and I know that was great. It was a great wedding. Beautiful. Um, she was beautiful. Um, and I don't know. I, um, from February to to now, you know, I've been doing a lot of things as far as school, just studying my butt off, um, finals are, like, happening now, my last final is Monday, so I'm studying and doing my hair for one of my anthropology classes, which I really do not like, but one of the topics that we're talking about is AIDS, um, which is very important, people, get yourself tested for AIDS. Get yourself tested for any viruses or disease out there if you haven't done so already because this is very important and very prevalent, prevalent, yeah, prevalent, <laughs> couldn't even get it out, among um, African American people. So, you know, just get yourself tested to, to know, you know, don't go around not knowing or, you know, assuming, know, know who you're with, know what they got and what they don't got um, because it's something that, you know, it only takes one time takes one time so you know just reading that and just really consuming myself in it because the book that I'm reading is AIDS, AIDS and Accusation and also an anthropology book I have which combined together um, but it's talking about AIDS in Haiti and how it's just basically taking over Haiti we hear a lot about you know Africa we hear you know maybe a lot about even Haiti when it comes to AIDS but it's so sad. It's so sad because there's so many causes of why this um, virus has taken over. Um, and it's a lot of reasons that it didn't even have to happen. So it's very just, it's very just sad to me and very close to heart because just hearing stories about actual individuals in this book talking, um, you can't help but to feel sorry. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm reading. Like I said, I got an exam on Monday, and we I guess I'll be tested on that. But that's my last exam, so I'm excited. Um, but school does start, summer school does start in um, May the 9th. So I got like, what, a week and so I'm out. But anyway, that's school. I'm a junior. I'll be a senior this summer. Woohoo! I am so excited. Oh my gosh, like finally almost over. I got my associate's degree already, but... It's nothing like degrees, and it's nothing like accomplishments that you um, were able to uh, to attain. Um, let's see what else has happened in my life. Um, hold that thought. Hold on. I am back. Get this camera. Sorry for all the movement. I don't like seeing movement when I'm watching something. 
But I must show you guys one of the things that I have been doing within this semester is Ta da! I pledge Delta Sigma Theta, the best sorority in the world. There are other sororities out there that are, you know, okay. I'm not going to down the sororities. But Delta Sigma Theta, um, I am beyond. Like, I, <laughs> it's so much that has happened in my life. Um, but this one is very interesting to me. Very interesting. Um, but yeah, I probated April 9th, and um, I don't know. Like, it's weird because I feel like I have my life back, but then it's not the same, you know, as it was. Which is a weird thing. Is that a good or a bad? It's just weird to me. But um, just, you know, having new sisters and just the whole bond of sisterhood, the, the whole lesson in itself um, about life, individuals, God. Like, you know, you just look at things differently. Um, I have much more of a respect towards God, um, of things that I've seen over these past months, um, I don't know, I, I really got a lot of things that I've, um, thought about, but, you know, that's just, I know it seems random, but this is just what I've been thinking, <laughs> um, let's see what else, um, I got in an accident with my car, I know this is another random thing, and I told up my car, and, um, I don't know, within the accident, I really thought I was going to lose my life. And it just, like I said, those are one of the things that gave me a better respect towards God. Because things that he did within the accident that didn't have to be done. Um, so, you know, I don't know. Like, the accident, accident was like when it was raining, a hydroplane, um, and my car just kept hitting, like, the rail of the bridge which was going to, which could have fallen um, onto oncoming traffic on another road. Um, and it was pretty high. <laughs> so if I was to hit it and um, hit it good to, or to the point that I either flipped over the rail or hit the rail where it broke and I fell, it was a fall. That it was going, it was a long fall. Um, but that was one way that I could have really been gone. And I, as it was happening, just, Pray to God, please don't let me go like this. Don't let me go like this, Lord. Um, and then once my car stopped, it turned towards oncoming traffic, which basically it just turned the opposite way that I was going. And um, I don't know. Like, there was no traffic at that time. There was no traffic. And somehow, some way, I hurried up and moved my car to the side of the road. I don't know how that was possible because my bumper was embedded in my tire, my back tire. So I don't know how it moved because I don't know. I don't know. Other than I know it was God because it was impossible to human people. Like that is just impossible. But of course, anything is possible with him. And um, like no sooner that I moved my car, semi trucks like back to back kept coming. And I knew right then like, you know, I'm supposed to be gone for the mercy, but, but for the mercy of God. Um, he saved me and didn't have to, like, God is good is just an understatement, like, there's no way that I can ever thank him for what he did that day, um, and what he, what he's been, what he's been doing these past months and weeks. Um, I know th there's a lot of things that I don't understand in life, but one thing that I do understand is that I do love God, and I am trying to live, to to understand him, and to understand myself, um, and the decisions that I make, and just not just wanting to be a better person, but wanting to understand, wanting to understand life, wanting to understand God, and I know that people can say, "Oh, you never understand God," or you know, just don't try this or don't try. I am the one that I want to really have a relationship with God. And I know that people actually have to do things to have that relationship with God. And I'm not saying that I'm, I've tried everything and I'm doing everything, but that is where my heart is right now. That's where my heart is right now. It's just really 
wanting to know him. Um, I don't know. I know I'm random, rambling, but, you know, God is good. And there's not a day that should go by that you shouldn't think about him at least. Um, and, you know, thank him for life. Thank him for life. Take time out of your day when you're even walking to your car or whether you're walking to the mailbox or whatever you may be doing and look outside because you don't have to be granted that day. You don't have to be granted life. So, I don't know. I just absolutely adore him and I thank him for me being alive or me, period, and my family and my friends. And just taking care of things that, you know, that I didn't see no way possible of um, being taken care of. I thank God. So, I don't know. This started out as a video that I didn't intend to, <laughs> to talk about something like this. But it's heavy on my heart, evidently. So, I don't know. God is good. But other than weddings, um, pledging Delta Sigma, Theta, <laughs> I, um... Just been studying for my finals. Hopefully I got honor roll. If not, then I don't know. This anthropology class is very boring to me, which is not an excuse. Um, so I just hope I have at least a B because huh, me and boring classes just don't get a well. Get, get um go well with each other. I can't even get it out. But um I don't know. This is just my life. I don't know what, what else has happened. I don't think nothing else interesting has happened because Delta Sigma Theta has consumed my, some, my semester. So, which is fine. <laughs> but, um, I don't know. You like my jacket? You like it? Yeah. So, anyway. Let's take that off. <laughs> But other than that, um, God is good. Um, this summer, hopefully, I can find me, like, a job. I'm wanting to find a job because I need money. I need more money. Even though I get money for school, it's just not enough for my rent. I'm thinking about moving sometime soon. I want something smaller, something cheaper. Um, I don't know. I need money. I don't have a car right now. My dad's working on getting my car fixed, even though they said it was totaled. He's trying to get it fixed. Hooray, Daddy! <laughs> but, um, yeah, this semester coming up, um, hopefully, I don't know, I have statistics. I have some kind of criminal justice class, because my major is criminal justice. And I have some Latin American and sign language class. I don't know. I just picked those two because they're elective and none of them other important classes that I need are available. So, yeah, we'll see how that goes. But I think I'm going to change sign language. I've learned sign language in fifth grade. I just don't have the time for that right now. I just don't have the time. I need to focus on my major and they need to start playing and give me my classes. <laughs> so, anyway, so statistics. I see suck at math so I'm taking statistics a term it's like a uh, I don't know it's I don't know it's an a term class but anyway yeah so I'm taking that by itself and then I'm going to take other classes b term so yeah I don't know I think this summer's going to be pretty boring but at that I'll be hopefully finding a job to work so, I need an easy job. Easy meaning I need something that's not going to stress me out because I'm working because I need to, yes. But I'm not, I'm not trying to break my back or my feet or my legs to be making a dollar. So, yeah. Once I get my major, then maybe. But, no. Like, no not happening. So anyway, need a couple of dollars to pay these bills, get these people from calling me all the time and me changing my voice up. I'm so tired of that. <laughs> y'all know y'all do that. Y'all know y'all do that. <laughs> Anywho, if y'all don't change our voice